we will be doing into this video a bat wing liner so this is the eyeliner for specifically hooded eyes so if ever you want to know how i created this little liner for hooded eyes as you can see as i open my eyes and then i close them you can still see the wing then definitely keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified every time that i post a video so let's get into this wing liner makeup tutorial right away hello beauties i was feeling a little bit purple today so that's why i have a dark lip color and i thought it would be fun to do just a simple liner and to try a new technique for hooded eyes just because you know my eyes just tend to disappear all the time when i'm doing my eye makeup and this is especially for hooded eyes the liner just disappears instantly and it makes me so frustrated and we are all frustrated with this everybody that has hooded eyes knows that when you do a wing liner it just disappears all the time and it might just be my new thing now that to have like a bad wing liner so that's what we're gonna do today we're gonna try it because my eyes just like to do its own thing and i'm not gonna put any tape or anything so we'll go straight into it like this and of course my face is done everything is done and if you have any questions about the products that i use you can go check it out in the description box or you can always ask me a question and everything or dm me on instagram all right so today i'm gonna be going into the huda beauty life aligner which um the reason why i'm choosing this one is because it's, it's like 48 hour proof i never tested it personally but i know it just doesn't smudge at all and that's what i need so first step is to get a liquid liner or a gel liner that will be waterproof and that doesn't smudge because hooded eyes is the worst pain in the world when it comes to smudging eyeshadow liner anything i'm gonna be using a little morphe brush which is the m250 slash one and it's a little liner brush and i'm gonna explain to you how i do the bat wing liner which i tried yesterday with an eyeshadow but obviously it's a different technique with a liner so let's go do it right now so the first thing that we will do is that we will create the line on the outside and we will bring it really really high and of course what we're gonna do is i'm gonna be uh, keeping my eyes open looking at the mirror and i'm just gonna be applying the liner hopefully you can see it as you can see I bring it a little bit lower just because my eyes just want to mess up. All right, so now that your line is done how you want your liner, the thing that you're going to do is that you're going to bring it on the side. Even when I open my eye, the wing is still going to be there. You can fill in a little bit if you want. And then that's the wing that you're going to see. So even if my eyes are open, you can still see the wing. This string is crazy. It dries so quickly. It's... <laughs> annoying it's as precise that i can get it so now what we will do is we will line the lower lash line as precise as possible so you put it very very close to the lash line and i like to bring it depending on your eye shape to the middle of the lid and then another trick is you open the, your eyes all the way and then you will put the liner where it goes so when you close your eyes or you open it the the liner is still there so i'm just placing it there depending if you like a big or a small liner i'm doing a big liner just because i want you to be able to see it properly and how i do it and of course i have to add more product all the time because it dries very quickly and then you can always put a little bit bigger or higher depending on how much you want it like right now my liner is kind of going downwards it's all good so and then what you do now is you connect the liner together as you can see it creates kind of like a bat wing shape depending on the shape that you want but i think it looks pretty nice and that's literally like how you would want your wing to be if you're looking at someone or if you're talking to someone of course like it creates like a nice little kind of graphic liner in a way it gives like a nice little effect especially if you're talking like this or if you're talking like really with your eyes open like usual um your liner will still be there and will enhance your eyes and then to finish off the liner you just fill in all the gaps that you have so on the side i think that is the first time that i try this liner so if it is not perfect i am not a professional in wing 
am in no way a professional in wing liners. <laughs> in no way shape or form do the rest of the liner i'm gonna put a little bit in the inner corner just because we need something here i'm gonna put some on my hand and take my little brush to be super super precise and put the little liner here next to your lashes this is my bat wing liner i'm gonna go do the other eye real quickly and then i will be right back with my mascara and my lashes on all right so the other side is done and in the process there was no more so there's no more liquid liner i used it only a couple times and it's all dried out inside it's doesn't last long i mean for the the time it lasted me it's really not that worth money i guess <laughs> so keep that in mind i had to take another liquid liner and that's how it turned out so as you can see you can see the wings on my eyes and then when i open my eyes ooh, the liner is still there of course i did it way bigger than what i would normally do just because i really want you to see how i do it and how it's done you can always put it a little bit smaller depending on your preferences i like to have a big liner statement and the fact that it does kind of like a graphic liner at the same time when i'm like my eyes are half open it's just really cool i think it's such a nice touch to it and i think we should do more bat wing liners because we don't see it as much people are kind of i guess scared and i changed the shape a little bit because bat wing liner would be like this and then go down like this i decided to go backwards and like this just because i wanted to create like a nice design on it um if you have any questions on how to do the bat wing or anything that you have to say drop them down below i'm gonna answer them and i just want to say that that's what it is that is the makeup tutorial for today a really simple wing that will fit everybody that has hooded eyes normal eyes depending on what you want and i think it would fit even for monolids because bat wing liners is just made for that so tell me if it's um too scary for you to wear or do you like the little grungy type of thing on it anyways tell me down below i really want to know and that's what it is thank you so much for watching i really hope that you enjoyed the video don't forget to like comment down below subscribe and hit the notification bell to see all those awesome videos so i post five videos a week monday through friday and if you don't want to miss any videos again make sure to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified every single time that i post one so i really really love you beauties and i will see you in the next one Bye, beauties.